He has helped some of the best runners in the world reach great success. And even though he may not take a lot of credit for it, at 85 years old, he is being honored for it. KXY 4's Katie Curry is here now with the story of the legendary Tracy Walters. Nadine Tracy Walters coached the U.S. Olympic track team as well as some of Spokane Olympians like Jerry Lindgren and Don Cardon. But perhaps his greatest legacy is coaching high school track. He's never ending work he has done to make kids better runners and better people. It is the very reason he's nominated for a Citizens Hall of Fame award. What a day to run though, huh? That's good, Ash. Way to go, Hank. Way to go, Marcus. No, almost all of them by name. Tracy Walter's track career spans more than six decades. They all call me Grandpa Coach. And he's such a great guy to be around. It's like basically like having a celebrity around you the entire time. And at 85 years old, he's right where he wants to be and he won't be slowing down anytime soon. I keep looking in the old bits and I don't see my name. <laughs> it's kind of the essence of, of life. When you're willing to work hard and you care about the people around you and you care about your community and, 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 and if you can be a little bit a part of that, I think it keeps us young. No matter where coaching has taken Tracy or who he has coached. Look at Jerry's smile. He's just a high school kid. <laughs> he always ends up back here at North Central on the same track at the same school he graduated from. That was back in 1949. The reason is simple. There's a kind of a family loving environment that kind of develops. Each runner that steps onto this track becomes a part of the Walters family. Their success? Unless everybody gets sick, they'll win a state championship in cross country. Is his success. Even long after the kids graduate and move on, they become a part of him. Nice work, guys. He's got a motor, if you know what I mean by a motor. Even if their running career ends here, Tracy hopes to teach each kid the best runners are even better people. And it's not the miles in your shoes that counts, it's the people you run with along the way. It's hard to capsulize. Even, even, even right now, and so many thoughts and memories and so forth are just flying through my mind. And there just aren't words that are descriptive to who just makes things wonderful. Tracy is one of the many incredible Spokenites nominated for a Citizens Hall of Fame award. If you would like to attend the awards breakfast on April 14th, we've attached a link on our website with more information. Reporting live in the studio, Katie Curry, KXLY 4 News.